everyone my name is Amanda welcome to my channel um, I know I haven't posted some videos in a while so wanted to apologize for that I um, been having some issues with my anxiety so when it gets really bad I don't feel like I'm the safest to um, be driving other people around so just decided to take a break and Kind of work on that so it's been a few weeks um, that I haven't done any Lyft or Uber driving um, I'm not even gonna be doing any today I uh, had a doctor's appointment which I think went pretty well um, so I have a type 2 diabetes so went to the my annual diabetes checkup which kind of the last couple years I did it for the most part like online or over the kind of video appointment thing they do. So this was the first time in probably like three years that I've actually went in to the doctor's office. So, and from what the doctor said, I think everything is good for the most part. And I am gonna be on my way home. Um, I did, however, though, after the doctor got out of there, because. I think it's just with going to the doctor you just feel I always just feel kind of overwhelmed and like I want to get out of there and I don't know who's there because they're actually really sick with something so I kind of just want to get out of there um, so I decided before I go home I was gonna stop by Sonic because they have this uh, diet cherry limeade in this ginormous cup here which is one of my favorite things that they have there so I decided to get that and then um, picked up some Pan Express for dinner um, later tonight and I'll put Josh's in the fridge. Um, yeah, so I'm glad that the appointment went well. Um, I still have to call and set up an appointment with my doctor to talk about my anxiety, a different doctor that I talked to about my anxiety medication to see if that needs to be changed. So I'm not sure why, like, I, it's like, I don't think that the anxiety ever goes away. I just think sometimes it's more livable than other times. Like it's, it's more under control and I can work and do like normal life and pretty much like just function normally. But then I have these things happen every once in a while where it's like this huge amount of fear just to leave my house or go for a drive or anything. This is like the first time and maybe it's been four weeks where I'm like, okay, yeah, I'm going to get in the car and I'm going to at least drive around. I still don't feel like I want to do right share right at this moment, but I may this weekend or I may next week get back into it. And then I'll be able to let you guys know the, um, the breakdown of, you know, pay and all that stuff. But I am a little nervous about it because um, gas really went up again. Um, and in a short amount of time, because today I had to put a little bit of gas in the car. So, but it was $5.29 a gallon. Um, so I just did five gallons. It's like, I know whatever gas is expensive. I feel like I'm not filling. I'm not like, yeah, I just filled up. I'm just thinking like, this is how many gallons I want because I don't want to spend, you know, to fill this car up is going to be easily between 80 and a hundred dollars or maybe around 80. Uh, but yeah, I was like, no, I don't need that much gas for just driving around today. But it's kind of like, oh, when I get back and driving, like I know that Uber and Lyft have not increased like what they pay me like my rate card is exactly the same as it was before and the temporary fuel surcharge thing is gone like it expired it's time they were doing that so I don't even know if they are doing anything extra or increasing rates at all um, you know before this break I had some conversations with other writers about on their end how much the cost has gone up for them to um, you know get a car with either Uber or Lyft. It's significantly gone up on the um, customer's end, 
but on the driver's end, my rate card's the same. Like, it has not changed. So, the drivers are definitely not the ones that are making the more money. I mean, I think how I make it work is I try to take advantage of those promotions that they do. Like, if you do this many rides, you get this. Or if you do rides in this part of town, we'll give you this little extra. I think that's how I make it work. If those things weren't available, I don't think that it would be worth it with the all the other expenses such as gas which is the biggest expense um so i don't know but i'll be curious to see i think i'll give it a try next week see how that goes but i did want to give you guys an update i know i did like a short one minute video for you guys just showing when i did kind of escape to the coast for a day and come back but i wanted to do a follow-up video um just to let you guys know why I haven't uploaded any like Uber Lyft videos and what's been going on with me. So when anxiety gets so bad, I basically, I can go through these periods where I just stay at home and I, I don't even want to leave my apartment. I feel a lot of fear just even leaving. And that's kind of what it's been like for the past three weeks to a month for me. So I've been doing a lot of like projects in the house, um, different cleaning stuff or baking or organizing stuff, like just trying to do something to make myself feel like I'm doing something productful. Um, so that's just what I've been doing. Um, but uh, yeah, I, yeah, that's, that's pretty much what's been going on with me. Um, when I was talking to Josh, he was saying like that it would be a good idea to do like a vlog type video. Um, um, so I thought it was a really good idea. So I just wanted to kind of explain what was going on. Um, but you know, I should have some more content for you guys. And, and, uh, I do have some other ideas and things that I want to do and I'm starting to feel a lot better and be able to do a bit more. So definitely we'll have more things coming. Um, if you have any ideas or suggestions, please, uh, comment, um, and uh, like this video um, and I will add things to the list um, my mother-in-law wants me to do um, a video about the um, grotto here which is this beautiful uh, garden or maybe it's more than a garden it's beautiful um, and so I'm hoping I will get that done soon I'm not sure exactly when I'll be able to do that but Rhea I know you want me to so I'm going to do that um, but it might be a bit just depending on the weather and everything. Um, and we do have some travel stuff in the future. So we'll kind of have to like see with all of that when exactly I can do that. But, um, yeah, any other ideas you guys have or any videos you like that you'd like to see more of, uh, please just comment below and let me know. Um, but until next time, see you guys later. Bye.